And I'm not going to give up on us having a future together. Damn it, I will kill you first. No. Yeah, I love you, Whitney. And deep down, I know you still love me. Chad, will you get out of here while you still can? Yeah, damn it, go back to your damn wife. No, I don't love Latoya. I'm getting a divorce, I'm going to marry Whitney. Stay the hell away from my daughter. We're taking her back to Harmony. She never wants to see you again. I'll come back to Harmony to get you, I swear. Over my dead body. <laughs> Go, go now. I don't care what you have to do. This isn't helping you or Whitney. All right, all right, I'll leave. But I'm coming back for Whitney. We will be together. I promise. And the nerve of that boy. I mean, how could he think that you would want him back? After his wife damn near took you out with a bullet tonight. Now, Whitney, I want you to get packed. I want to get the hell out of this godforsaken town as soon as possible. Yes, Daddy. I'm going to call the airport. I'm going to make sure that nothing is keeping us from leaving. Come on, honey. Let me help you pack. Can I help? No, Liz. My daughter and I do it just fine. Thank you. And thanks for asking. Coming to L.A. has been nothing but a nightmare. Not for just Chad and me, but Teresa, Ethan, and Fox. They almost died tonight. Plus, Gwen lost her baby. Oh, Gwen. Oh, I forgot all about Gwen. I was supposed to assess her condition before we left. I have to get to the hospital. Honey, tell your father where I've gone when he gets off the phone and... and and he can pick me up on the way to the airport, okay? And what... Do you want to pack this? Uh, no, you can leave it. TC, we're ready. All right, let's go. If we go down the back way, there uh, won't be as many stairs. Stop by the hospital, pick up your mother, and get out of this godforsaken place. And then we'll get back in harmony. I hope I never see Julian Crane again. I wouldn't count on it, TC. Not when Julian is in love with your wife.